In 2008, we implemented a new hired safety subcommittee. Due to an increase in the overall number of associates, having over 50 associates with less than one year of experience, and knowing that our first aid rate is traditionally higher with new hires. Also, the last three of our four recordables at that time were new hire associates. Here at Pendleton, we use our new hire subcommittee to educate our associates on all the safety material that they cover during their orientation days. The process lasts one full year. During that year, associates are educated on a safety topic for one full month. For example, lockout tagout. During orientation, new associates review slides on lockout tagout, but during new hire, they are educated on who performs lockout tagout, when to perform lockout tagout, and who second verifies lockout tagout. They are gaining knowledge on the subject, not just reviewing some slides that they may or may not remember. They also are taught how to perform area audits, behavioral audits, and how to give feedback when a negative or positive behavior is observed. New hire is also made to be fun. We have played games such as tie your shoe with your non-dominant hand to emphasize hand safety. There is a lockout tagout training board to see if an associate can identify the correct lockout tagout method. It's kept educational, but it's done in a more lighthearted way. All new associates hired to Pendleton go through the new hire subcommittee, whether it's a new production associate, a new manager, or even someone transferring from another Millican plant. Therefore, we believe anyone new to our plant benefits from the new hire subcommittee. After completing a full year in new hire and meeting all requirements, associates graduate into one of our other subcommittees. By this time, the associates are educated in our safety process enough to feel empowered and realize they own the safety process as much as anyone else here.